Kamisato, one of the most distinguished clans in all of Inazuma. Despite Ayato's trickery in regard to the Tri Commission's affairs, he is nevertheless a loyal subject. His past misdeeds shall be excused. As the head of the Kamisato clan, he's in a tough position. With all the political upheaval, he has to contend with public disquiet on one hand, and a bunch of self-serving degenerate public officials on the other. Yeah, it's best not to dwell on it. All I can do is make sure to look out for him when he's at home. <laughs> I only wish I could have met Ayato sooner. He really taught me something. You can kindle the warrior spirit, even in the weakest of bugs. Yep, I really took that one to heart. Ah, if it weren't for those words of wisdom, I'm pretty sure I would have given up Beetle fighting after losing for the 780th time. Yeah, I guess sometimes it takes a warrior to understand a warrior. When we're playing trading card games or battling beetles, we're always totally on the same wavelength. As the head of the Kamisato clan, Brother always has a full schedule of places he needs to be. I do try my best to share his load, but there is no changing the pressure he is subjected to all year round and the toll it takes upon him. <sighs> If you see him, remind him to take care of himself for his sister's sake. Sometimes, when I'm taking a rest up in a tree, I overhear the Shrine Maidens talking about him. Sounds like he's pretty important and super busy most of the time. I don't get it though. <sighs> it's only work, or whatever. So why doesn't he just... Not do it. The Yashiro rascal. He's always been an unpredictable one, even as a child. Don't be taken in by his warm smile. There's no knowing what devious scheme might be brewing inside his head. It's really quite maddening. What do you mean, sly as a fox? Hmm. If you're trying to insinuate that he and I are anything alike, you are sorely mistaken. <laughs> <laughs>